Hey, what's up, guys? I have a quick steelbook unboxing, ho hopefully quick, because it's um, you know, it's old now, or it's been released a couple of weeks now, or almost a month now. I'm not really sure how long it's been, but um, I got this uh, five film Jurassic World Jurassic Park steelbook um, on eBay for twenty. I think it was twenty five ninety nine or something like that with a uh, couple dollars shipping. So let's just say twenty eight dollars, twenty seven, twenty nine dollars, something like that. It was less than thirty bucks, and um. I think it's going for 45 to almost 50 everywhere else, all the retailers and stuff. So I'm glad I got it online because um, um, I was never going to pay that much for it. I do already own all these films except for the most recent one because I haven't even seen that one yet. But uh, I'm just going to end up selling those. And I'm just kind of consolidating space too because I figured, and I, it's a steel book too, so I may as well get it steel book. Um, um, when I bought this, I bought it, like I said, from eBay. And I got when I, when I received this in the mail, it came in a. Do I even have it? I don't think I threw it away, but it, it was not a bubble mailer. It was just a simple plastic, like, envelope type deal that was sent in the mail. So there's no padding on this at all. And so I've scoured over this, and I tried to see if I could see any visible dents. And I don't see anything visible, so maybe I got really fucking lucky. We'll see. But I was very upset when I saw that. I was certain there's going to be dents in here, and there probably are. But uh, I guess I'll have to find out and see. So I'm going to open this up. And we'll see just how bad the damage is, if there is damage. I hope there isn't. We'll see. Well, this is a matte finish. Um, like I said, I had not initially planned on getting this because I, I already own almost all the films. But um, I thought it'd be cool to get. Um, I guess I can show you this quick. This is the the back on it. It's got the information on the movies. <clears throat> all the special features. There's this um, synopsis. You can pause that if you want. And then it comes with a digital copy for all the films. And they're all PG-13. Okay. On quick inspection, it looks like it's okay. No spine slash that I can see. Maybe I got lucky. I guess we'll see. Hold on, let me check inside here. Oop, this is coming off. Oh. Okay, that's funny. <clears throat> Hold on, I'm just sorry. I'm looking at this. So I came with it came with the digital copy code. The digital copy code is on the back of this um, thing here, and it's just, as you can see, there's a hole punched through. So the code, one of the code that's right there, is actually structured. I'm gonna have to make sure that that's okay. And that's actually for Fallen Kingdom too. So that's fucking funny. Um, I came with this thing too. This is um. Interactive Baby Blue. Is this a toy? What is this? Download. Oh, it's, is it an app? Scan this code. This code? I don't fucking know. Whatever. Anyway. Um, here are the discs. There's Jurassic Park and Jurassic World. Let's take a look. This was coming off, actually, when I opened it up. There's The Lost World. And there is Jurassic Park 3. Which, Jurassic Park 3 is not a fantastic film, but it's okay. It's, you know. Here is Jurassic World, which I honestly didn't... I thought Jurassic World was okay. I thought the characters were kind of stupid and bland and I don't know. It's a scratch on the... right there. This looks okay. And then <clears throat> here is... Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Hold on, let me take a look at this. The discs look okay. Discs do look okay. And here's the back. Maybe just a background scene. How does this look? That is the same scene in the front and back without the dinosaur. It's kind of whatever. But whatever, it's not a big deal. I wish it had the logo up here. I mean, obviously I know what it is, but still. Do you guys see any dents? I don't see any. I'm surprised. Like I said, it can't. It was not packed well at all. But I just, I guess, I got lucky. So that's cool. Let's do. In fact, I'll leave, I'll leave Jurassic World: Fallen Kingdom two out because I'm gonna end up watching that soon. Jurassic World here, and then I'll put three back here. Oops. This is Jurassic World. Wait, no, Lost World. 
I haven't watched The Lost World in a while. I think I maybe, maybe I watched it a year or two ago, but I don't remember. I don't have very fond memories of that film. I remember it being okay. I like the first one, though, of course. I watch the first one every year. I think I've only watched Jurassic World once. So, yeah. I'm surprised this turned out just fine. I was expecting it to be terrible. I messed up, so I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised, so... I may have to, I may mention it to the, the seller that they, in the future they should do that because they got lucky. I'm guessing, but uh, whatever I guess whatever whatever whatever. What I noticed there's actually a uh, helicopter with some is that a dinosaur back there being carried. There's actually some different footage in the back there versus back here. And I think these are otherwise it's the exact same image I think. The front and back just kind of land, but whatever. All right, I guess that's it. Nothing, you know, major. I think that's that blue, isn't it? The bl well, actually, there's a shade of blue to it, so yeah, it must be blue from Jurassic World. Like I said, I've only watched the movie once, and I honestly didn't love it. It was okay. Enough that I want to buy the steel book. Blah blah blah. Who cares? Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I am going to um, end it here and make another video, actually. So. Thanks for watching, and I will see you around for more steelbooks and other unboxings, horror stuff, um, you know, all that good stuff. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.